Oklahoma weather sponsored by Executive Homes. And it is that time of day where we are heading out into green country. It is time for Hometowns with Annie Brown. And Annie, we're heading over to Claremore today. What's it looking like out there? Yeah, that's right, you guys. All smiles here in the weather department because... Now that the weather's a little bit calmer, we can go back to my favorite segment. We do have some winds out of the south. Good morning to you all in Claremore. Let's talk about what you can expect as you're getting your day going. We will need some coats early this morning. We do have temperatures 26 specifically for you guys. You will have wind chill values in those teens. Plenty of sun is in store. A few clouds moving in for the afternoon, but not impacting those temperatures. We should be trending in those upper 50s for this time of the year. Right around 57, look at this. We're topping out at 63 and we're not stopping there. We're actually going to see those temperatures about 64, 65 for you all later on today. So windows up on the way into work, windows down on the way home from work. Keep those sunglasses handy. We will get some breaks. Now we are headed to Pryor for tomorrow. Go ahead and send us in those weather picks. We'd love to hear from you what's going on in your area, especially those farmers. I'd love to hear about any updates. I know a lot of cows are being born right now and we've been posting a lot of those pictures. So send them on over and I'd be happy to share those with your specific uh, timeline for tomorrow and your hour by hour temperatures. As we're looking ahead at the surface map, we're staying dry, high pressure remains in control, and that's gonna kick any precipitation out. We will get a few clouds dropping into our area, but again, nothing is gonna be overcast. We'll keep that sun around not only for today, Tuesday, Wednesday to Thursday. For those of you working at a car wash right now, yeah, you're gonna be very busy this week. A lot of people getting out and about. We have plenty of days, several days to get that car wash uh, taken care of. And on top of that, temperatures warming up quite a bit. Might wanna get the car wash done today, especially if you can uh, have a convertible or something, you can take the top down because this weather is going to be fantastic. Again, the normal for this time of the year is 57 degrees. We're like at 60s and then 70s. 70 degree warmth starting tomorrow. And not just one day, we're tracking a stretch. So Tuesday into Friday, 70 degree warmth. So the 65, I'm loving this number, but we're going to be spoiled with even warmer temperatures as we head into the remainder of the work week. Pensacola Dam at Grand Lake. This is all part of Wade's RV Weather Camera Network. I'm going to stand off. Guys, just take this in. How beautiful. Just like almost just tranquil if you look at it. Makes you want to relax. Peaceful. Oh. Just that not a cloud in the sky right now. Notice how calm those winds are. We're not dealing with any powerful winds. Great start to the work week. Hard to believe this is the last day of February because February has been all over the place, but it's going to finish very quiet. 33 degrees, feeling like 28 dew points in those teens. Seeing those temperatures across the area, 27 in Skokie, 31 over Grove, 29 up in Coffeeville. Pulled in a little bit tighter, 26 in Bixby, Broken Arrow, 27 in Claremore. But if we go to Owasso, 37 over there, 37 up in Skytuck, 32 over in the Hominy. So temperatures varying quite a bit depending on those winds this morning. We will have some clouds making their way in. That's going to help cap those temperatures. Southwest winds helping to boost those temperatures. Mostly partly cloudy. If you've planned 5, 6 o'clock, there you go. 63, getting about 60 degrees. Very pleasant weather all around. 65 for the high. Went ahead and bumped us up a few more degrees from what I was seeing earlier. I think those southwest winds and a little bit more sun really going to help us get to where we will be in those mid 60s by this afternoon. 56 and the 52 sunset now at 618. You might notice a little bit longer daylight. Mardi Gras tomorrow. Not a bad looking day. Plenty of sun. Tuesday, Wednesday into Thursday. We'll keep those south winds. Nothing that's going to be above about 20 miles per hour up until Friday. And that's ahead of our next storm system arriving just in time for the weekend.